Hi. With this movie we will show you, how to store form field value, into a cookie, and use it later, to filter your database query. We created two pages, the first one contains a drop-down menu and a button. Our visitors will select their country here, and then they will be redirected, to the next page. On the next page, we have a dynamic table, that displays database query results. Currently it shows, all of the airports from the database, but we are going to filter them, by the country selected on the previous page. So, let's switch back to it and set up the cookie. First, select cookie, in the HTML5 data bindings panel. And click the add new button. Enter a name for the cookie. We call it, country. Click the OK button. Then, we select the plain, HTML button on our page. And then we click the Add New Behavior button, in the Behaviors panel. Select, Control State Management, in the DMX Zone menu. Open the Action menu. And select, Set Cookie. Open the Name menu, and select the cookie that we've already created. Now, we should assign a value to the cookie. Click the Dynamic Data button. And under Form, select your input field. Then, click the OK button. You can set a path, absolute to your site root, for example some subfolder, where the cookie to be valid only. Also, you can specify a domain, where the cookie to be active on, for example with, or without, www. We leave these fields empty, as we want the cookie to be valid, for the whole website. Select, how the long the cookie should be valid. We'd like it to expire, after specific time. So we enter 10 days. Click the OK button when you are done. We also add another behavior to this button, which will redirect the users, to the next page. Click the Go to URL behavior. And here we select our page, containing the database query, that needs to be filtered. Click the OK button, when you are done. Now, let's go to the airports page. Our query returns all of the records, from the database, so we need to filter it. Open, Globals. And right-click, Cookie. Then, select Add Variable. And enter, the same name, that we used for the cookie, on the previous page. Then click here Query, and open its options. Select the Filters tab and add the database column, that you want to filter your query by. Click the server data bindings icon, in order to select a filter value. You will find the cookie, under, Globals. Select it. And click the select button. We do the same for the condition. This way, the filter will be applied, only when the condition is met. In this case, the condition is, when cookie, named country, exists. Click the OK button, when you are done. Save your action file, and let's preview the results. When a visitor selects a country, and presses the continue button, a cookie is being set, and then he gets redirected to the next page, where our database query results are. Here, you can see that, the query is now filtered, by the country, selected on the previous page. Even if we go to some other page, and then return here, the query is still filtered. The filter will be applied, until the cookie expires, or its value changes.